Nearly two dozen small earthquakes have rattled Mount Rainier over the past week. But seismologists say there is no cause for worry. In the past, these swarms last a couple of days to a week or so and then die out, said Paul Bowden of the Pacific Northwest Seismic Network at the University of Washington. The first of the 23 quakes struck on September 11th near the volcano's summit. The largest of the quakes registered 1.6 magnitude. Earthquake swarms are common at volcanoes and usually don't signify any threat of eruption, Bowden said in an email. So I'm treating this as a single eyebrow raised halfway, he wrote. Yeah, I see you and we'll be watching, but I don't think you're going to attack. Most volcanic quake swarms originate in the hydrothermal plumbing system related to slight changes in the temperature or groundwater pressure that cause cracking of the rocks, Bowden went on to explain. The recent quakes are shallow, which also suggests they are not connected to the deep movement of the magma, supposedly. Rainier experienced similar upticks in the past two years in a more sustained episode of seismicity in 2009. But with all the earthquake activity going on in the world right now and the strange weather activity, you add the solar activity going on, all this taking place after the eclipse on August 21st, 2017, what do you guys think is going on? Is Mount Rainier about to erupt? Or is this just a small chain of earthquakes that is completely normal? Leave your comments below this video. Thanks for watching.